Hi kids! Welcome to Bahay Aralan! In this video, we will be making predictions. When we make predictions, we guess or figure out what will happen next using the information or clues we got. For example, when we see dark clouds and lightning in the sky, hear thunder and a strong wind starts to blow, we can predict that a storm is coming. Why do we say so? Because of the clues. And what are those? Dark clouds, lightning, thunder, and strong wind. Right? Another one. Andre keeps on using his phone while walking in a street full of people. What do you think will happen? Probably, he will bump into someone or something. Right? Why? Because he is so focused on using his phone while walking in the street. Next, Zion's teacher reminded him and his classmates to study because they will have a test the next day. However, instead of studying at night, he just played video games. What do you think will happen? Probably, Zion is going to fail the test. Another example. Mike accidentally broke his dad's favorite watch. He went to his dad to tell the truth and say sorry. What do you think will happen next? Do you think his dad will scold him? Probably not. And instead, his dad will just remind him to be more careful next time. Next, Nico was raking a huge pile of leaves. When he turned around, he saw a dog running toward the pile. He could not stop the dog. So, what happened next? The dog scattered the pile of leaves. Another example, Toby's mother gave him some money to buy snacks at school. He put the money in his pocket and walked to the school bus stop. Unfortunately, he did not notice that there is a hole in his pocket. What do you think will happen during snack time? Probably, Toby will have no money to buy during snack time. Next, Tim got caught in the rain while going home from school. He had no umbrella or raincoat. He got very wet. What do you think will happen next? Probably, Tim will get sick. Next, Cindy was cooking chicken adobo when someone knocked on the door. It was her best friend. They talked for about 30 minutes. Cindy forgot about the adobo. And so, what happened next? Cindy's chicken adobo was burnt. Next, LJ was strolling around the park when she found a wallet full of money. Her parents never failed to remind her to be honest all the time. So, what LJ did was, she picked up the wallet and tried to find the owner. Another one, Betty stayed up late to finish reading a book. The next day, she woke up early so she won't be late for her class. What do you think will happen during her class? Probably, Betty will feel sleepy during her class. So, that is how we make predictions, kids. We have to figure out what will happen next based on the information or clues we got. Okay? That said, that would be all, kids. Thank you for watching. Stay safe.